Ceramics in the Expanded Field is eight artists who work in clay and ceramics, but as the title suggests, they integrate it with other mediums. So if a visitor is expecting to come in and see pots on a pedestal, that's not at all what they will see, which is exciting. You're gonna see a 40 foot long dock. You'll see nearly eight foot tall figures, low riders, a huge platform with an array of ceramics. You're gonna see a site specific piece, which uses nearly the three floors, a metal network. It's almost like drawing in space, creating a landscape, but at the core are the ceramics. All the artists in the exhibition are working with both clay and ceramics and other mediums. A lot of the artists in the show, they're looking at clay and the social history is embedded in it and also the objects produced with it over the years from you know, porcelain to the bricks in our buildings. At the core of many of the works is this history that they're acknowledging and then also kind of overturning and trying to find a new way of thinking about clay and thinking about the forces that have acted on how it shows up in our environment and our lives and how colonialism and capitalism are really reflected in its histories. The show was inspired by really the field itself and how over the past decade or even 15 years Ceramics has just exploded into the contemporary art world. For so long, it was kept separate and not really considered um, along with sculpture. But it's an exciting moment just to see you know, how, how far, maybe not how far ceramics have come, but how far the rest of us have come in understanding you know, where it lives in the field and its possibilities um, and looking at, at it really as, as sculpture. <laughs>